Well, I wanted to tell you that uh, the Pinsmore case is settled. I broke that uh, July the 20, 24th, and now it's come out. But this is an article talking about it more in detail. So I hope you like it. Bye. Hannah Smith, reporter Hannah Zakeemlotter.com 10 days before the July 31st trial, the Pinsmore $63 million lawsuit was settled. Stephen T. Huff Family LLC attorney Gabriel Berg of Kennedy Berg LLP confirmed to the headliner news in a July 26th email that the case is closed. The parties amicably resolved the matter. Berg said, request for more information to Berg, Pinsmore LLC and attorneys representing defendants, Monarch Cement Company and Ozarkist, Citywide Construction Products Company, have not been returned, according to online federal court documents. A notice of hearing cancellation was filed July 21st. Until July 17th, parties filed motions in the mine, which prevents parties from filing certain evidence, supports, of motions and objections. Order. This case has reached settlement, the Pacer docket entry, signed by District Judge Beth Phillips, says. The trial setting is removed from the docket. The parties are ordered to file either dismissal paperwork or joint status report by Oc. 4, 2017. Stephen T. Health Family LLC, owner of the Pensmore Mansion, filed a lawsuit in 2015, asserting claims for fraud, breach of contract, breach of implied covenant of good faith and fair dealing, tortuous interference with business expectancy and other related causes of action. Pensmore planned to ask a jury for exemplary damages in an amount sufficient to punish defendants for misconduct and to deter defendants from ever defrauding any other person again. Pensmore also sought damages in an amount no less than $63 million. The lawsuit alleges that Monarch and Citywide Construction withheld Helix, an ingredient in Huff, a special assigned concrete recipe in the home, as construction. In July 2016, Pensmore also claimed to end the game of hide and seek as to where the Helix disappeared to, alleging it was used in the construction of a shell not home belonging to Deborah Rowe, chief financial officer of Monarch and a citywide director and board member, among other small projects. According to the complaint, about Pensmore Pensmore Mansion, located in Southern Christian County, is a 72 square foot home. Larger than the White House and Pythian Castle, there is also vastness to the mansion not only in mass, but in its theory. Elf began the construction of Pensmore in 2009 with intentions for the home to be a model of engineering and mechanical innovation, literary inspiration, catalyst for research and discovery and accommodation for collaborating bright minds. As reported in previous headliner news articles, Pensmore has hosted guests including Drive, Ben Carson, retired Lieutenant General Jerry Boykin and is home to a Liberty Tree seedling. Pensmore LLC partners with universities to allow student tours of the home and the property, is also a farm. Watch www.keenlauder.com for more information. Please like us and share with your social media. Please subscribe and click the bell to be notified of our new videos. Stay tuned. This video is Creative Commons. You have permission to download, copy, and distribute it by any means. What would you say about your 20s? Was it good? Was it bad? Was it somewhere in between? How would you look back on that, that decade in your life? Um, I don't really like you, Luke, so I'm not going to answer your question. All right.